proc now, so we're gonna see probably see some veterans here now. Yeah, we have that one on the pioneers. Sherman though, walking into, uh, I mean, driving into a landmine there at the same spot the other squad actually got killed earlier. Is he gonna take some shots from the pack? Yep. First shot did a lot of damage, the second shot did a bit less, but he is now out of range from that pack. Should retreat that high squad. <laughs> Some weird shot there from the Sherman killing off that mine that the next player put down. Whoop. Is the pack gonna kill the Sherman? No, it's gonna have a main gun destroyed. Wow, pings off the Sherman there right away. Oh, I mean again. And sexy combined arms here from the Axis player, pinging those uh, squads. Uh, the Volt squad, uh, squad on the left got fent off by the sniper down. Oh! That was a strafing run, but it did absolutely nothing. Maybe it killed one of the crew members of this pack. Oh, this is some bad micro-ring from the, from the Wehrmacht player. Sending in a lone pack gun into the American base. And now the American player can recapture that anti-tank gun and use it for his own advantage. Oh, and the Swimwagen almost gone down too. He's gonna get strafed, but he survives because of the new uh, the new changes to the strafing run. The changes are that the less squad squad uh, squads there are on the field where you use the strafing run, the less uh, effective the strafing run is gonna be. So if you're gonna try uh, if you're gonna try and strafe a sniper. It's not gonna die. But if there's uh, like uh, five Grand Deer squads like in this area and you strafe, then the strafing run is gonna be a lot more effective. As it should be. It shouldn't be effective against lone squads, it should be effective against multiple squads. So, also a nice change here in the beta. These riflemen are gonna maybe get out of there soon because. No? The Sherman is gonna change this battle. Because we have another pack out on the field. This Sherman is gonna try and flank this AT gun. But he should be careful with his riflemen though because they are on low health. Another Sherman! Very sexy! Driving around killing off that anti tank gun. Oh, another dead squad from the Axis player. We have two snipers out one from the Axis player and one from the American player. They're probably gonna want to counter snipe each other because both players know there's a sniper roaming around in these areas of the map. That bunker in the middle here is gonna go down. Oh, there it goes. And LeBron is gonna try and prepare to counter those Shermans with putting down some more mines. But it is he gonna get enough counters to those Shermans. There's two Shermans now out on field from the American player. Um, uh, LeBron doesn't really have anything against those Shermans. We have a dead pack or a decrude pack. 
and we have a pack being built from the Kriegsbergs. And I don't think those Germans are gonna have any problem problem countering a single pack gun without support. Enemy unit down. Another nice uh, counter snipe right there. Ah, uh, Sherman is, has found the pack right now. This is not looking good for the Axis player. His base is being ra raided by two Shermans, as we speak. And the Sh Shermans are not gonna have any problems dealing with that pack as I said earlier. That's uh, one Sherman here in the... Beast took a lot of damage down. I'm down to half health. Schwimmerwagen can't do much to do <laughs> against the Shermans though. I think a fresh grenadier squad popped out from the medic bunker here in the east. Yep. They're gonna get out of there because they are being overwhelmed by the squads here. And then here we have a sniper out and uh, that one rifleman squad. Maybe we should try and cap some points there. Maybe cap this one, kill up the medics. Why not? Uh, so the Wehrmacht player doesn't really have much. He has two pack guns and one Grenadier squad, one Bolts Grenadier squad, and that's it. He must try to uh, kill off, at least kill off the sniper right there. Ah, uh, maybe his other sniper got killed. Can't remember which. What made with that? We have another strafe killing him with pack gun. Was shooting at the Sherman. Didn't do any damage though. Okay, the Venom player is gonna decrew this pack gun. But he's been pushed back so far into his base that this uh, game seems very hard to come back in into right now. Enemy unit down. Oh, you can see the Sherman one-shotting the Pioneer squad right there. American player got his bars upgrade right now. So those Volks Grandiers are not gonna stand a chance. Against those riflemen now. Oh, they do got veterans level too, so should be do fine damage from long range, but not in close range. Those uh, riflemen are gonna rape their asses. Yes, <laughs> my good friend the Iron Man usually says when some somebody is getting owned. Okay, so the American player now has all three victory points and is probably gonna win this game. Um, the Sherman is uh, trying to kill off this pack gun. Try and use attack move instead of attack ground. Just select attack move and click on this AT gun. And, uh, then you should be able to kill off these uh, unmanned weapon uh, much easily much more easily we have a flag out in the base from the Axis player and uh, we have some nice push out from the Axis right now we have two uh, packs and AT gun in the back. 
Uh, but the American player has a sniper out and he's got a lot of riflemen and also a lot of munis to do those strafes. You can see there we have a lot of casualties because there was a lot of squads, uh, I mean a lot of forces out here from the Axis standing in a group there so they took extra damage. Still, those two riflemen are gonna do more damage to this Axis squad. It's actually gonna try and capture this heavy MG-42. And it's gonna be unsuccessful with that. Sniper had to retreat there from the fire from the grenadiers being revealed by the pioneers. Is the Vermont player gonna hold out much longer? This pack has been done done some excellent damage to this vehicles here in the middle. But smartly Heaton he moved out of the way from fire and repaired his tanks. Oh, is the rifle gonna, squad gonna go down here? Nope. It's gonna survive. The Axis player is pretty much pushed into his bed and can't do anything to fix this. I think a King Tiger could have done a difference in this battle though. Sherman gun down to the Flak 88 fire. Good stuff, good stuff. But is it too late because of that three victory points? The tickets for the Axis player is ticking down very fast now. You can see his almost at 150 victory point tickets at the 27 minute mark and 30, 31, 32, 33 seconds. Rifleman should probably get out in there now. Something went down. Ah, probably the pack. That sniper is doing some very nice damage to the Axis player. And the Axis player is having a hard time killing him off. Now we built a swim wagon. It's gonna try and hunt it down. Hunt down the sniper now. Oh, the AT gun died from the 88 fire. But the sniper made it out for the American player once again. The Volkswagen just pa uh, picked up a bar. And he's gonna feed his. Uh, that's gonna feed his uh, medic bunker right here with uh, zombie Enemy has 100 points and grenadiers, and they're gonna pop up. Yeah, there we go. Another free squad. I think I've seen two free squads from the Axis player right now. So far in this game. Ha! <laughs> this uh, AT gun got three vehicle kills. Excellent. Placement by the Axis player. Defending his base there. That Sherman is perfectly placed though, he can fight on this side and on this side. Defending that victory point which he needs to win the game. Victory points ticking down even more, 62 victory points left for the Wehrmacht player. Not looking good, these pioneers are gonna try and cap once again, getting sniped.
and we'll probably get killed by the Sherman now. They run away just in time for the shell hit the ground. Stand firm, allies. The battle is ours. Oh wow. Look at that sniper. Vet 3 sniper. 24 kills. Very effective sniper. And uh, Axis player <laughs> has been struggling to kill off the sniper the entire game. And is probably losing because of that. Well, he is losing, but maybe he lost because of that. The sniper got too many kills and destroyed his confidence in getting back to this, to this game. Mortar team out from the ally player. Probably not see so much action though because this game is almost over. You can see there's nine victory points left from the X player. Some grenades here in the middle. But the Axis desperately need to capture one of these points. As you can see, we have GG out. And LeBron is killed. That was the game. Pretty good game. Uh, I, hope, I hope to see you guys in the beta. I've been playing uh, some games. I think it's very fun to play the beta because of these nice new changes to the to the different units and gameplay. So that is the game. Hope to I hope to see you guys next time.